if your dog has toys, you have to make sure that your child does not mess with your dog while they have those toys. Boom. On the contrary, you have to make sure that if your child is playing with toys, your dog does not mess with your child when they have toys. Yeah. Additionally, if the dog is eating or chewing on a edible treat or toy, you have to make sure the child doesn't mess with the dog in that context. And vice versa. If the child is eating, you got to make sure the dog doesn't try to steal their food. And the last one, if you are sharing attention with your dog, you have to make sure your kid does not come over and try to pet the dog in that situation. I want the dog to have a more healthy relationship with you, the owner, where they don't feel like they should do this in the first place. Mm -hmm. And you could help coach those interactions a little bit more effectively. But it starts with us making sure the dog is not seeing you as a resource and something that they need to compete over with the child.